And court documents connect an accused teen killer to another high-profile murder. Local reporting you can trust. You're watching KRQE News 13 at 10. The first person to be charged in the murder of two Albuquerque teens is now tied to the recent shooting death of a Sandia High School student. Newly unsealed court documents reveal 15-year-old Julio Almentero was at the scene of the shooting the night Sean Markey was killed. News 13's Chris McKee is here with more. Jessica and Dean, the details are slim, but prosecutors say Almentero was armed with a gun at that house party the night that Sean Markey was killed. Prosecutors now want Almentero kept behind bars. This is Julio Fabian um, Almentero. A few days ago, Julio Almentero was a faceless suspect charged in the 2018 deaths of two Albuquerque teens. And there has been a motion for pretrial detention that's been filed by the DA. Facing a judge today, the 15-year-old Almentero is also now facing questions in the death of Sandia High School senior Sean Markey. But this time a hold will be placed. A Metro court judge wouldn't allow Almentero's face to be shown in his first court appearance today as he's charged with murder and a slew of other charges in the 2018 killings of Colin Romero and Ahmed Latif. The teens' bodies were found in December, buried on the Mesa west of Rio Rancho. Investigators believe Almentero was seen in Snapchat video holding a gun while in a car with Romero and Latif on the day the teens disappeared. Do you saw swear? There are two other suspects in the murder case, Stephen Goldman and Jimmy Atkins, who are both being held behind bars on other charges. Almentero is the first suspect to be directly charged in Romero and Latif's murders. Prosecutors have requested that Almentero be held in jail through trial. And um, he will be held until he sees a district court judge on the dangerousness hearing. In filing for that hearing, Prosecutors also indicated that Almentero has a tie to the shooting death of Sean Markey. According to court documents, Almentero is known to have been at the homecoming after party in the Heights a week and a half ago where Markey was killed. Prosecutors also allege that Almentero had a gun that night. We called the APD and the DA's office to see if Almentero was their suspect in Markey's murder, but we could not get an answer. No one has been charged with Markey's murder at this point. Jessica. All right. Thank you, Chris. District Court has yet to set a date on when a judge will hear arguments and decide if Almentero will be kept behind bars through trial in the 2018 murder case.